what does it take to design a great processor? So design this system on a chip that you mentioned. Is there some insight you can provide in this chaos of engineers, designers, leaders, uh, you know, the people that think about how much this is all gonna cost, all the whole mess of it? I'm of course very partial about it. I've been in this company for probably more than 26 years. But um, I'll, I'll, I'll argue that there are a couple of things that are ingredients for the success. So we talk about the fact that you have all those different technologies, they evolve at their own pace and you have to be good in each one of them and you need them to make them working together. So, so you need to have an engineering organization that it, with a co with incredible collaboration culture because everybody has to be working. The train is going to leave the station. Every cart needs to be there, right? When it leaves the station, it needs to leave on time, especially in the phone business. You can change Christmas. You cannot change Black Friday. You cannot change all of the selling seasons. So the phones are going to launch on time and every technology needs to be there. The engineer needs to work as one. And we do have that at Qualcomm. The other thing, you have to have incredible uh, discipline uh, because, um, you know, those are very complex systems. So in one way, you have to design with quality uh, because in many cases, we're going to be ramping production and even before we have the silicon back and you have to rely on, on our simulation models and you have to rely on, on the fact that you design uh, for commercial applications. That takes that takes a while to build, and uh, and you know it's probably been the history of a semiconductor business at Qualcomm. So you mean like the framework of how many people can use simulation software and all that kind of stuff to build the thing with a hard deadline that you might not even get back from like manufacturer before. Yeah. Any, <laughs> You're not allowed to no, have any mistakes. No wonder our name is Quality Communications. That's oh, I never even thought about the qual part. Quality. So quality, and there's a bar that's high, and you're not allowed to mess up. I mean, to me, as an engineer, that's exciting. Hard deadlines, um, no room for mistakes. I love it. Super stressful, but I love it.